Hello, my name is Trevor Tegder. I'm a senior technical support engineer at Quest. I'm here today to show you how to migrate public folders in on-demand migration. Here is an overview of the public folder migration process. Note that users will need to be matched, mapped, or migrated in the account section of the migration project prior to migrating public folders to ensure that public folder permissions and account-related mail settings are migrated properly. We will now go to the Quest on-demand portal. We'll click on Migration. We will navigate to the public folder portion of the project. Click Open Project. And here you will find public folders. Click Open. This Getting Started section of the Public Folder Dashboard shows the basic workflow of the migration process. First, we will configure connections by entering the source and target migration admin accounts. The source and target migration admin account should be global administrators with an Exchange Online license. Click Source. Enter the source migration admin account credentials. Click here to grant consent. Select the source tenant migration admin account and click Accept. Click Save. Click Target. Enter the target migration admin account credentials. Click here to grant consent. Select the target tenant migration admin account and click Accept. Click Save. Click Finish. Next, we will discover public folders. Click Run Now, Next, and Finish. You can now click on the tasks to monitor the Discover task for completion. Now that the Discover task is complete, we can click on the Public Folder tab to select the public folders for migration. You can select public folders one by one or select all as necessary. Once you have the public folder selected, click the Migrate Public Folders button. Subfolders are selected for migration by default but can be unchecked if desired. Also, public folder content is migrated by default, but this can be unchecked to only migrate the public folder structure if desired. I will keep the defaults and click Next. You can schedule the migration for off hours, but I will select to run it now. Next and click Finish. You can now go to the Tasks tab and monitor the task for completion. To learn more, visit quest.com slash on-demand-migration.